Hello, I'm Bo. And I'm Preston. And we'll be your anchors for episode seven. We would like to wish a happy birthday to Kelly Ozzetti, Christopher Cruz, Aaron Grit, and Juliana Grillian. Now we're going to go to pay in with the sophomore people of the week with Aiden Allen and Anna Mann. I'm Peyton Kluver. I'm here with the sophomore people of the week. Who am I here with? Aiden. Anna Mann. Uh, first of all, what do you have to say to the people who voted you? I don't know. Thank you. Uh, what's your favorite memory of the year so far? Sports. Um, definitely homecoming. That was a fun week. Uh, you guys are sophomores, so is there anything you're looking forward to for the rest of your like high school career? Graduating. For real graduating. Okay. Um, anything else? No. No. All right, thank you. Thanks, Peyton. And now to our community segment at the gathering in Gilman with Corbin. My name is Corbin Wright, and I'm here with your community segment with... Kathy Perzee at the gathering and the Front Porch Cafe. Okay, so what made you want to start this business? Um, let's see, we've been, the shop has been in business for 24 years, but my husband and I before that did like craft shows, like we tore down barns and, and built furniture and things out of that and I painted and um, just a group of us, all girls got together and we're doing a craft show and one of the girls was a realtor and said, let's let's just get rid of our stuff I've got this there's a place we can rent for a little bit and so we did and it just took off and that was 24 years ago so there was nine of us that were owners at the beginning so now it's down to just me so okay. yeah cool what's been your favorite part about having this business oh probably just meeting the people just oh we just have we, and we have, we're like a family here, all the girls, you know, we've got younger girls that work in the cafe, so, you know, some of our employees are like mamas to all of them, but, but anyway, but meeting all the new, all the people, and, and they become your friends after a while, and then we have a lot of people that, you know, maybe they live in Iowa, but they have kids at Purdue, so they'll be driving through, and you see them just a couple times a year, and they're just always excited to be here, so it's, that's always probably a big reward to make people happy so nice uh, so what's your favorite thing that you sell oh gosh why well, would I probably could say fudge and we all we all like the fudge here <laughs> but um, I don't know probably I, I don't I Christmas is always a special mm. time you know the shop always looks so nice and mm. the girls all do such a great job decorating and everything so um, Probably, probably that I would say. Some, you know, probably just Christmas time is probably our most favorite thing. So, uh, and then the last question: What are your hours? Our hours are Monday through Saturday, ten to five, and then Sunday, twelve to four. So we are open every day. Um, and our cafe hours, like you know, you can come in and get a drink and desserts any time of the day. We do close our lunch. Um, dinner specials at two o'clock so but yeah but the cafe is open as well so thanks Corbin now on the crosswalk talk with Gage who am I here with Chris Butler Casey Niskus Eli Hombuckle Mario Grimaldo Landon Mrs. Schroeder Sandy Potter Anna Mann Mario Martinez Arian Ellis what is your favorite childhood game? Fortnite. Fortnite. It'd be tag. Probably tag. Mario. I would say sorry. Old Maid. Candyland. Uh, Super Mario Karts. What is your favorite movie? Finding Nemo. Finding Nemo. Order Marvel movies. Grown Ups. Probably The Exorcist. Christmas Vacation. Forrest Gump. Elf. All right. Uh, probably a TV show called Last Chance You on Netflix. Movie, but all right. Inside Out 2. What kind of career do you want to pursue for the future? Plumbing. Plumbing. An actual resources officer. Probably the military. Retirement. I want to be a travel labor delivery nurse. I want to be a physical therapist. Um, teaching or a labor and delivery nurse. What is your worst habit? 
Fist bumping everything. Fist bumping everything. Probably chewing on my fingers. My worst habit, biting my nails. Letting people take advantage of me. Being late to almost everything. Uh, I procrastinate a lot and push my work back and then do it last minute. Biting my nails. Since it's almost Thanksgiving, what are you most thankful for? Kaysen. Chris. Just being here. Uh, just my family, my parents. My family. Definitely my family and my friends and all my coworkers. My family, my friends, including my school family and friends. My family. Uh, my family and my friends. My mother, who's had four surgeries. Thank you. Thanks, Gage. Now on to The Game with Caleb. Eli. Emerson. All right, nice to meet you guys. You guys look really excited. Bryn. Lucas. Bryn. One at a time, please. Okay. Uh, you guys are going to be answering some movie trivia questions today. Okay, <laughs> movie trivia. What is the name of the snowman in Frozen? Olaf. Correct. Next question. Which 1995 film is considered to be the first full-length computer animated feature? Is it Toy Story? Correct. What is the name of the fashion designer in The Incredibles? Edna. Correct. What is the main character's name in Ratatouille? Is it the name of the movie Ratatouille? No. Oh. Good try. It starts with an R and then an E. Remy? Correct. Which movie features a villain named Lord Farquaad? Shrek. I'm going to let her have that one <laughs> because she needs some points. Who is the main villain in The Lion King? Scar. Correct. What island is Moana chief of? Motunui. Correct. Emerson, what movies are you very familiar with? None. <laughs> what is the highest grossing film of all time? Highest what? Grossing. So it made the most money. Home Alone. No. Matilda. No. It's a movie about, like, traveling to a different world. It's, it's about outer space. Back to the future. No, that takes place on Earth, man. What are oh, you doing? Yeah, you're Utopia. Right. No. Star Wars. No. It's Avatar. What are you guys doing? Bro, what? Okay, third question. What actor played the character of Iron Man in Marvel Cinematic Universe? Uh, wait, I know his name. It's, uh, like, uh, Arnold. <laughs> no, it is not Arnold. <laughs> Um, is it something Levine? No. Can you give us a hint? His initials are RDJ. Robert Downey Jr. Correct. <laughs> Finally, we got a point on the board. What is the name of the fictional African country in Black Panther? Wakanda. Correct. Yay. Who is the main character in the TV show Breaking Bad? Walter White. Correct. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Next question. In Finding Nemo, what type of fish is Nemo? Clownfish. Correct. What spirit animal does Moana's grandmother turn into? Uh, a chicken. No. Uh, a fish? I mean, no, technically. I mean, I think it might be a fish, but no, it's not a fish. It's big, and it's an aquatic creature. A shark. No. Octopus. No. A manta ray. Oh. Last question. What kind of dragon is toothless in How to Train Your Dragon? A black dragon. <laughs> Technically, kind of, but no. A frost dragon. No. <laughs> this hurts me. These two, these two last questions I made because the movies are coming out. Moana 2 yeah. and a live yeah, action How to live, Train Your Dragon. And you guys aren't even getting prepped. Okay, Nightmare. Then. No. <laughs> Nightwind dragon. No, Night Fury. Oh, that's it. That's, that's, you guys are done. Congratulations, Lucas Summers, for winning Yay. movie trivia. Yeah. Clap's all around. Okay, that hurt my brain. Championship round. What animal is Poe in Kung Fu Panda? Uh, panda. Correct. In Monsters, Inc., what powers the city of Monstropolis? Uh, like the bedroom doors. Like the, they get the screams from the doors and then it powers them. Correct. What is the name of the cowboy in Toy Story? Woody. Correct. In Frozen, how many brothers does Hans have? Uh, he, he has like over 300. No, not even close. <laughs> Six or seven? N no. It, he has a thousand. It's double digits. Oh. Just two. Uh, 16? 
less. Twelve. Correct. Okay. Last question. What fairy tale object was the villain of Shrek looking for? The magic mirror. Correct. Let's go! I won! Oh my gosh, I'm him. I'm him. <laughs> sure you are, pal. Alright, good job. Now to this episode's Grill and Chill drawing for a free Grill and Chill lunch. Hi, my name's London and I'm here with Mrs. Blank for the Grill and Chill drawing. Whenever you're ready. Take 57. Here we go. Bo right. Congrats. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in to episode 7 of Bearcat News. We like, we'll see you in two weeks for the next episodes. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving! Thank, Thank you, you for, for watching. watching.